Yo guys, what's going on and welcome back to another episode of Nagai to Glory. We are here with possibly the biggest episode so far. Although if I'm talking that much hype, I'm only going to be disappointed, I feel like. It is ultimate team of this season time. That's not strictly true, is it? The best team of the seasons have been re-released and we're going to try and pack ourselves some of them. We have got some huge packs from Icon Swaps and from Top Swaps. And we've also got red rewards and packs from my best champs finish that I managed to get over the team of the season period. So without any further ado then, let me stop wasting any more time. Let's jump into the MTG. So here we are then live in the NTG. Now I'm gonna preface it by saying, if the audio sounds a bit weird, it's because I've tried to edit it out the sound of a Boeing 747 that my PS4 is making because it is very, very hot. Uh, we're actually entering a heat wave in the UK, not that anyone asked, but yes, it is ultimate team of the season. Now let me start off by talking about the champs rewards. Over the team of the season period, these are the red rewards we have received and to be honest they're okay they're all right they're not great so i'm not expecting anything massive but we did manage to get 11 wins this weekend which means i do have two we did manage to finish 11 and 7 which as i did mention earlier is actually my best finish in the foot champs over the team of the season period we have had a whole team of the season that i have once again skipped out and it was the seria team of the season and once again we have also changed the team with the Serie A team of the season promo. So this is my current team that I go into champs with. We've got SBC Tenali. If we could get his team of the season, that would be class, because obviously he's in the team, as you can see. Thanks, Captain Obvious. We also did the flashback Kessie, which I was thinking about doing, and then I realized he gets an Ivorian link to Wilfred Zaha, my brain is enormous. Baggio makes a reappearance because he manages to get a strong link to the SBC 96 rated Insigne. But other than that, the team is, I think, exactly the same. All I need to change really is I'm going to swap out Nagai and Nakata in for Dalglish and Baggio. This is the current team. Upgrades on the team, I could probably fit in uh, Joshua Kimmich because obviously he gets the perfect link to Sula. And then Tonali would be great. If we could get Rafael Liao, he'd get the Portuguese link to Jao Cancelo and the strong link to Kessie. You know, there are there are players that definitely fit into the team, but they're all pretty good. So are we likely to get them? No, let's do it. We do have some items to deal with and they're probably the biggest items I've had all year. One of three 91 plus E-Figs team of the seasons. I say this every time so I don't try and disappoint myself when they're inevitably, you know, not that great. It's June, who cares? But this could be massive. We're going to go from left to right. I normally go from back to front, but we're going to go left to right. <sighs> Come on. We have got two of them. Player pick number one. Oh, is it going to be any good? No. No. I've already got Noya. And I've already got Courtois. Good fodder, but I've already got them both, I'm pretty sure. And no, I have, because I've actually packed both of them on an episode. I think it might be the last episode. I guess we go for Neuer, because he's actually in the team, and we can actually put him in and flex that we got on Red Manuel Neuer. Right, second one. Second one, please, please be good. Please be worth it, because I grinded this weekend. Please be worth it. Oh, I'll take an Allison. I'll take Allison. I mean, Allison obviously fits the Liverpool past and present. Chalanoglu, yeah. Akuna looks decent, but I've got Jao Cancelo. He's probably just not going to play. I think I'm going to go for Allison, just because I'm actually going to use him at some point in the future. And every stat is 90 plus somehow. If we manage to pack Virgil Van Dijk, we might have to switch up the team once again. Two red picks, two 95 rated players but two goalkeepers. If I change my mind, I've got decent fodder, you know? That's one way to look at it. But we do also have some massive packs. As you can see, I have got some insignificant packs here as well. I'm just going to ignore those and open those off camera because realistically, who cares? But we do have some enormous packs. We've got an 82 plus times 25, an 83 plus times 25, an 84 plus times 25, and my tradable champs rewards pack. We're going to start with the champs rewards packs. I think this is a 50k pack. I don't really know. I probably should know. We're looking for blues. Are we going to get a blue in our first pack? We don't, but it is a walkout. Spanish, CDM. Yeah, that's to be expected, but at least it's fodder. Right, an ultimate pack. Is this a 125k pack? These normally stink for me, I can't lie. These normally are rubbish. It's another walkout. Is it? Okay, I was going to say. 
If it was him again, I was going to throw hands. We are going to start with the 82 plus because that just makes logical sense. We want to see some blues. Blue. Even if it's an MLS, at least I get excited for just a little second. You know, just a little, a little, a little, a little glimmer of excitement. Because right now I'm getting nothing. Come on. Blue. It's blue. It's blue. Portugal. Yes. Yes, yes, yes. He fits the team. He fits the team. Ish. He kind of fits the team. He gets a perfect link to Cancelo. He was the one Premier League team of the season I actually wanted because he got a perfect link to João Cancelo. Yes. That's in the worst one. That's in the worst one. Why am I getting all these 95 rated team of the seasons? Just bump it up, you know? I don't mind. I don't mind. We take that, we take that, boys. That's an ultimate team of the season. We did actually get one. We got absolutely nothing else, but I'll take it. Okay, okay. Do you know what now? Regardless, I'm happy. We've got a red Neuer to add into the team, which is exactly the same player I've got already, but it's red now, you know. And we have a perfect link to João Cancelo. We've got an 83 plus and an 84 plus. We've got fodder. We've got players. We've got more ultimate team of the seasons, please, EA. It's June. You can just give me the good players now, because who cares? Come on. It's not blue. It's not a... It's not even a walkout. Oh, okay. Oh, righty then. Well, I'm glad we got the good one out of the way first. Because that's disgustingly poor. It wasn't even a walkout, bro. 25 players rated 83 and higher. Oh, right, okay. So, uh, got you. Now, that makes sense. We did get some players that were higher. Right, we did actually get 92 rated Sebastian Rodriguez, who looks like a mental card. He looks incredible. Yeah, happy with that. That's probably fodder, to be honest. I don't think we're going to fit them into the team. Right, now I don't want to sound greedy, but I'm going to sound greedy. Could we at least get a walkout, please? I don't think it's possible to get 25, 84, and 85 rated players. Please, EA. Please, show me the blue. It's blue. Show me a good nation. France, goalkeeper, my nan. What I've got is I've got a nice large nan. Um, my nan's dead. So that don't matter. I have what I can only describe as a goalkeeper curse right now. We packed three of them today. Three team of the season goalkeepers. There's only five I could have got and we got three of them. Anything else? Trent alexander Arnold. we'll take that. We will take that every day of the week. And some good fodder. Did we get any Conmebol Libertadores? We did. Torres, welcome, welcome. Yeah, take that. Take that every day of the week. And you know what? We've got some spare fodder. I believe there is currently a guaranteed team of the season pack in the SBC section. So I'm going to quickly do that if it is there. The following Thursday. All right then, boys, here is what we have done with the team. Now, I'll be completely honest, it's been a couple of days uh, since I recorded the first initial mental pack opening. I did eventually put the fodder into Team of the Season eFig Guarantee Packs, but as I was opening them, my monitor just completely black screened. I assume it overheated because it's mentally hot right now in the UK. But yeah, it wasn't great. You didn't really miss much. We got Gwen Doozy in our first one and I think Jeremy Fringpong in the second one. It's also actually taken me so long to record this second part that Team of the Season is actually no longer in packs. Shapeshifters Team 1 came out today actually. But this is the team. Ruben Diaz has come in. Xavi has come in instead of Tonali so that we have a centre mid and Ruben Diaz on full chemistry because otherwise it wouldn't have worked. I think I'm going to do the Philip Lahm moments SBC. Finish that off and get him slapped in there. I mean it, it would provide another strong link to Sula. Not that he needs it because he's got more links than I've had hot dinners. Without any further ado let's jump into game one. <laughs> team number one. I can't see half of it, EA. I can't, I can't see half of his team. Right, well, he's got he's got a shapeshifter Alfonso Davies up front and Cam and centre mid by the looks of it. I, 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 I don't know who he's got at Cam and centre mid because I physically couldn't see it. Brexit is Brexy. What is going on? This is gone, gotten off to the weirdest start. Oh, nice. We've got lag as well. Brilliant. Good. Oh, by the way, I was being sarcastic. Here he is, literally the big man. Oh, he's been absolutely destroyed. Neck nuts. 
Zampana! That's what I'm 1 0 up, boys. That's 1 0. Right. Oh, what a poo shot out, man! Oh, that guy. Yes, he play him through. Beautiful. One touch. Finesse. That's football from the NTG, that. That is football, lads. Beautiful. Beautiful. What, is it? what, a, what a touch. <laughs> what a touch. Insigne. In a bit. In a bit. Go on, Kessie. Kessie's through. Little dig. The Ivorian link up. The Ivorian link up. Do you know what we need to get Kessie on full chem? An icon from the Ivory Coast. An icon midfielder from the Ivory Coast. Why on God's green earth, EA Sports, is Yaya Torre not an icon? Well, you got me. By all accounts, it doesn't make sense. He would literally solve all of my problems. Ah! What's that? Hello. That was a great... What, what a touch! I said this last episode, I'm not going to put a man on the line, even though it is June, almost July. And I lived to regret it last episode. And I do again. We... We... <laughs> We have... Oh, he's Naruto running on me. He, he, that, that caps his age at maximum 12, that does. He's Naruto running on me when he's losing. Right. Oh, he's nicked it off Van Dyke. Man, this guy is so good. Honestly, he's so good. If you want to celebrate, lad, we can celebrate. You know what I mean? You know what I'm trying to say. Half time it is. Three to the NTG. One to Brexit is Brexit. Yeah, not a bad first half, to be honest. This guy's scored a free kick, give him credit. I deliberately didn't put a man on the line because I didn't want to be that guy. And then he Naruto ran on me and I regretted it instantly. Hold on, is this subbed on Insigne? This is, this is some Insigne versus Insigne battling going on here. Is he just... Uno reversed me. Xavi! It took a deflection, but we take it. Now, it would be rude to celebrate when it took a deflection. I'd like everyone to know that I was 100% going to celebrate, but he skipped it before I could. Oh, God. Okay. Took a risk there. Hasn't paid off. Uh, he didn't quite win the ball as I envisioned that he would in my head. I'm just going to jump. There you go. Go on, that guy. Get out of his way. Get out of his way. I can't believe that. I can't believe it. Well, I actually, do you know what? No, I, that's a lie. I absolutely can believe that. This game is so bad. Yeah, that's pretty true. That's true, and yeah, that's true. Go on, DDC. Go on, DDC. Go on, keep going. Keep going. Good. Danny DaCosta, that's unreal. Danny DaCosta, that is unreal. The determination from him to just keep winning that ball. He wins that ball so much. He wins that ball so much. And another! Mate, I'm actually, I'm, I need to remove the slide tackle button from my controller. I can't do it. It would appear I can't do it. I'm absolutely shocking at them. I've now got two centre-backs on a yellow card and Kessie, who's nearly been done for manslaughter, he slide tackled him so hard. Oh! I've never done that school before in my life. I've never done it in my life. And I, could you, you could tell because I panicked completely. That worked so unbelievably well. Go on, go on Manuel. Oosh, have that. <laughs> Mate, Sula. This guy's got a family. Oh, there you go. Yeah, that's kind of you, Sula. Very kind of you. That's very kind of you, Sula, mate. That is, he's Naruto run again. Dear Lord, what a sad little life. Zaha's clear. And he's sweat it across. Because why not? I'll be honest, boys, I've heard a rumour, I've heard a rumour, I've heard a leak. Apparently, FIFA 23, the Japanese league is going. This is the last Nagai we could ever see on a FIFA. We might not see him again, so we've got to make the most of it. You know, we have to make the most of it. So if that means sweating it to him when we're already 5-3 up for a 6-3 win, it has to be done. It has to be done. And that has been done. To be fair, that's exactly what happened. 6-3. What a game. Six goals, two yellow cards, two Naruto runs. The game had it all. Goals from Zaha, of course. Nagai with a brace. 
Xavi, Kessie and Danny da Costa. Goals can come from anywhere for the MTG. Unlucky Brexit is Brexit. Hold that, mate. What a, what a game. Because my PS4 is sounding more and more like a Boeing 747, let's just not waste any more time. Let's jump into game number two. Game number two, I can see the whole team. Would you look at that? He's got a 78 non-rare, that's a bold choice. I can't believe I'm judging someone for having a non-rare gold when I've had a silver up front all year. Finish him. Oh! Oh! Kessie! I didn't speak in the build-up because I was trying to stifle a sneeze. But <laughs> what a goal. The La Croqueta, no one expects Kessie to have four star skills. The La Croqueta there was clean. Absolutely sent Kimpembe to the shops, mate. Kimpembe. Yoink. There you go, there's a slide tackle. It actually, it turned into a pass. That was probably one of the best slide tackles I've ever done in my life. Yoink. Kessie again. Thank God we got Kessie, man. He's one of the best players I've ever used. And look at this for a ping. <laughs> yep, love that. What a ping. Oh! No! Why is that not locked onto it? What? Why is that not locked onto anyone? That was criminal. The ping from Kessie. The touch from Nakata. He then sent Kimpembe for the 18th time this game. I'll allow it. I'll allow it. I'll allow it. Oh my god. Do you know what? Fair enough, game. If you don't want to lock onto a player when I absolutely rinse him and skill pass it, past his last defender, fine. Because if you're going to allow me to score with Nagai like that, I w I w I'll accept it every day of the week. I seem to be saying this more and more. That's, I think, the best goal I've ever scored for them. God, he's going for a second as well. Mate, Kimpembe just hasn't got it in the locker, you know. Kimpembe just hasn't got him. Nagai has got him on ropes. He's got him wrapped up in his back pocket, mate. God, Nagai versus Kimpembe, who comes out on top? We'll never know. <laughs> we'll never know. He's gone. He's gone. And to be honest, lads, I think I'm going to end it there. But it's ridiculously hot. I think it's 30 degrees plus. I need to turn my fan on in my room. My PlayStation sounds like a jet engine. And Nagai has scored the best goal I've ever seen in my life. He's 68 rated, by the way. 68 and he's done that 3-0 in 34 minutes a brace from that guy and a kessie goal again mental ridiculous let's say i'm ending it there it's perfect boys a friendly reminder by the way this guy has 65 shooting but if you look to the right 400 goals for the club in 358 games and none of those games are squad battles. If I sound like I'm shouting, it's because I'm currently competing for audio volume, audio dominance over my PS4. It's, it's, I, right, I need to wrap up, right? Thank you guys for watching. What an episode it has been. We've got some decent team of the season rewards. We've got a Neuer. We've got Ruben Diaz. I'm hopefully going to have Philip Lahm to add into the midfield. And I'm still annoyed that there's no Yaga Torre to make this perfect. Thank you guys for watching. If you guys have enjoyed, please feel free to leave a like down below. If you are new around here, please feel free to subscribe. Turn on notifications to get notified when my videos go live. And I'll see you all in my next video. See ya.